Alrighty, welcome everybody. Let's go ahead and show off the merchandise. So, we have three of these tins to open today. I'm going to get one of each. We got these, and then we have two of the lunch boxes. Etty with the raid, much appreciated. Welcome everybody. How did your stream go? For some reason, the stuff didn't come through, which is quite annoying. I wonder why the sound alert didn't come through. Anyway, how's it going? Welcome. Uh, let me just try doing this instead. Where is my regular regular stream look? There it is. Okay, and then we can go to Duplicate that yeah My bad I should have had this set up, but I decided I was gonna try something new and it has not worked So let's go ahead and just Bring this to the front Much better. There we go. How is everybody doing today? So we've got our protective sleeves ready. We've got the uh, free wristband, which came from Total Cards when we spent over £75 with them. The song is a bot. It is indeed. The song that is currently playing is Surrounded by Mr. Fiji Ouija. Another Monster Cat classic. I'm good, thank you. So we have two of these to open as well. Each one of these has five packs of boosters in. So what I'm gonna start off doing is just opening all the protective stuff because I don't want my stuff to be damaged once it is open. So we've got a lovely purple binder. Go. Beautiful. Our single sleeves. Go. How far did you get on um, building your triplets housing? Just put those over there. Where is the lid? There it is. You finished? Nice. Nice. Have they moved in or have you not created the triplets yet? Are they still in progress? So let's go ahead and put our wristband on. May as well represent. I'll put it that way so the camera can still read it. Totalcards.net Really great place for buying cards. Um, all the packs, all the, the tins came completely sealed, um, which is nice. And you can tell they've not been resealed by the way that they've been sealed as well. It's still manufactured. Um, no, I've not made them yet. Just moved your main sim into the fairy tree house. You made it. Fair enough. You got side. You got sidetracked. It sounds like then. Um, we also have one ocean bomb refreshment can. Sadly, it has come with a little dint, but that is fine. I was actually planning to just drink it. Um, this one is the Pikachu, which is cucumber flavor. So, who knows how that's going to taste. It tastes exactly like cucumber. Okay, at least they're not lying about the, uh, the flavors. You'll make a move in the triplets later. That sounds like a good plan. Alrighty, let's go ahead and open the first box let's get my pen knife ready always remember to cut away from yourself health and safety first you know as opposed to already having a pen knife right there we go so we start with our favorite which is pikachu obviously rubbish to one side So 
we have the lovely Pikachu shiny from there. Ooh, I'm trying to remember. I keep forgetting where my camera is because I'm looking at my screen and my camera is on the opposite side. So lovely hollow. So that's going to go straight into the binder. After we sleeve it. So these are only penny sleeves, I know. Um, I was trying to get some top loaders, um, but they were completely sold out, which was a shame. There we go. So put them to one side. Um, codes, if anybody here does play the online, here's the code. Feel free to pause it. I'll put these later. I don't use them, so feel free for anyone in the chat to take them. You don't know anything about rarity, that is completely fine. Neither do I. I'm just gonna go off what is on websites. So, codes are free, I don't use them, feel free. So now we have one, two. Now I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take it out and send. It makes it a lot easier. So we have four packs to open. One Sun and Moon, one Sword and Shield, and two Darkness Ablaze. As you can see there. So, which one should we start off with? I'll let the chat choose while I have a drink of my Cucumber Sparkling Water. So we've got left, right, middle, Sun and Moon. I guess is the easiest way to go about this. Sun and Moon. Alrighty, Sun and Moon it is. So, once again, code, anybody wants that, feel free to pause them. So we're gonna go, I believe it's four for the card trick. If I'm wrong, we'll change that for the next one. <laughs> But as far as I'm aware, it's four, so. Yep, we've done that right. So we have a rock, fighting energy. Let my camera focus. It has decided to be too shiny, even though these are commons. So we have a Lilma, a Passamian? I have no, like, I stopped playing after Gen 3, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, the Pokemon Catcher. Rowlet? No, that's one I have seen. An Alolan Grimer. Classic Spearow. Grubbin. That's a. Fero, a reverse hollow Togedamaru, and a Butterfree. I guess I messed up the card trick, my bad. But we will sleeve the hollow. I apologize if I'm butchering the names of some of these. You love Rowlet. <laughs> Rala is adorable. Oh man, these penny sleeves are a tight fit. I am regretting some of these. I might have to put them straight into the folder instead. Side loaders. And then we can order them next time. Go. He has a bow tie made of leaves. Let's check that out. Rowlet, yep. Rowlet with his bow tie of leaves. Original Trekkie Kit Kat. What is up? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for noticing the bow tie. Okay. I'll leave it up to the chat once again. Do it this way instead. One, two, three. I'll let the chat pick once again. Okay. 
All right, looks like it's up to Trekkie. Three. So then is this packet of Darkness Ablaze. Now, I'm hoping I still did the card trick right. Now, when I did it before, we still had one uncommon at the back. So, I guess I'll try five this time. Once again, anybody wanting the code? There it is for the online. So we're going to go five this time. No, we'll go four. We'll go four still, because that puts the energy at the front, which is what I feel like it's supposed to be. Um, drinking from the water prison. One moment. Ah, thank you very much for redeeming that. Okay, once again, we have grass energy. I have to actually turn these around, because I can't read upside down. Gathori... Gotharita. Really? This is literally just someone making a Goth Lolita as a Pokemon. It's Attacker's whiny voice. What the fuck? Okay, Pokemon Breeder Nurturing. Combuskin. Skitty. Another Rowlet. A Wishcash. A wishy wash, wishy washy, all my days. Kufant. I could have read that very wrong. Sinistee. They have just. I feel like some at some point they just started going right. Let's turn Pokemon into um, into just sentient things. Um. What, what, I was saving up to make you dab, but I couldn't resist the words water prison. <laughs> she said, oh, whoa. Well. <laughs> I mean, the water prison is a good one. Uh, so here we have the reverse hollow Suicune. And a Muck. I'll put the Suicune straight into the binder. Again, we will order these after. Okay. Sword and Shield, or another Darkness in a Blaze. The tea and the Elephant. I mean... It's... Sinist tea. And it's one attack is Furtive Drop. And then the Elephant was called Kufant. So Reverse Hollow means that the part of it that is holographic is the outside... Oh, so in both of these are reverse hollows. So the holographic is the outside of the card, whereas a hollow would be the picture that is holographic. And then you've got full hollows, which is obviously the full card. And we said sword and shield. Love and nothing more. Love the song. Love and nothing more. Once again, the code. I'm going to go one, two, three, four. I'm going to keep going with four. I like having the energy at the front. It is a bop. I love Monster Cat. You'll hear Monster Cat on every single one of my streams. It is the one I pay uh, for the licensing to use. And I just love it. It's got so much range um, because it is a music label rather than, you know, like a particular artist. Um, and it goes through so many of the electrical genres. You know, they've got pop, uh, dance, trance, freaking um, synth. Oh, there's so many more that I can't even remember. I think the, the actual list of categories of genre that they cover is like 15 to 20. Another absolute tune, a little too close by WRLD and Veronica Red. Okay, so 
Once again, we have a Grass Energy. I can't even read half of these. Corvus Squire. A Thwacky. Let's rearrange my hand here. And another Pokemon Catcher. Brasilia. Pharaoh Seed. Krabby, love Krabby. Galarian Zigzagoon. Gossifleur. And that is a reverse hollow Sinis T. And a Musharana. Too far away. Thwacky. Thwacky is shaped odd. Let's go back to Thwacky and have a look. Thwacky, 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 Thwacky. There he is. Yes, I could see that being um, oddly shaped indeed. I guess all that's left is the next pack of Darkness Ablaze. Once again, code. Gamal, what is up? Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? We're going to go one, two, three, four. I want to say this is a darkness energy. I could be wrong. Vibrava. Corvus Squire again. Rose. A Wishy Washy. A Kufant. Another Sinis T. Phoebus. Passamian, a Reverse Hollow Taurus, and a Tyranitar. Hollow Tyranitar. There we go. Beautiful. So that's the difference, like we were saying before. So Reverse Hollow, holographic on the outside. Hollow, holographic on the picture. Let's get both of those into side loader. That is those ones. Next up, we have the EV tin. So let's go for that one. Again, safety first. If you're using a knife, cut away from yourself in case it slips, then you're not going to hurt yourself. I'm guessing this is a hydrate, yes. That is Drink from the Water Prison. Thank you very much. Uh, much appreciated for the hydrate. I felt like renaming hydrate because hydrate was just a little bit too boring for me. There we go. So we have the lovely Eevee special card. Go ahead and put that into a sleeve. Never mind, it's also deciding to not fit, so we'll stick it straight in the book. It appears that the, the sleeves I've got are one millimeter too small, which is very frustrating. Once again, free codes. There it is. I don't even know if you can read that one, so I'll hold it up to the camera. Or 
already just must get ready for another for a meeting. No worries. Thank you for stopping by, Trekkie. It is much appreciated. Okay, so once again, darkness ablaze, sun and moon, sword and shield. I will let the chat pick which one opens first. Original Trekkie with the follow, much appreciated. You get to see the psychedelic stream part, which is the best gift on the internet. Absolutely love it. Sun and moon once again. Sayonara. Okay. Usual free code. Okay. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four. Okay, so we're starting off with a fairy energy. Rare candy. A pincer. How? I love the alert for when someone falls, it's great. I absolutely love it. It, it is honestly my favorite gif, which is why I made sure that was my um, follow gif. I just love seeing it. It makes me smile every time someone follows. Just because I get to see that. Uh, next we have a Poliwag. A Skamori. A Morlul. Fomantis. A Spiro. Poliwag is adorable. A reverse hollow. I have to turn this around to read this. Payukumuku. Yes, you heard that right. A reverse hollow Payukumuku. And a gold duck. believe it was this one. Let's have a look, see, check that they're the same. Yes, they are the same. Okay, Darkness Ablaze or Sword and Shield. Let's return ball of spikes. <laughs> yes. Poliwag, Poliwag itself is just like, um, well, I remember the original generation, so it was like one uh, evolutions one through three. So it was Poliwag to Poliwhirl. Pixel with the follow, much appreciated. You get to see the psychedelic stream part, which is the best gift on the internet. Thank you very much for following. Darkness Ablaze, left or right. So we're going to go one or two. So this is two. There we go. One or two. Um, and then it was Poliwhirl to Poliwrath. And then Poliwrath had the evolution into Politoad, which I thought was a little bit strange because it went from being like a big macho sphere with the spiral on its chest to being a toad, which made no sense to me whatsoever. I get that it was supposed to be like, Poliwag is like, um, uh, Poliwag is like a tadpole, but they have an actual Pokemon that is a tadpole, which, I was like, why? Why? Okay. I'm always coming back to you. Okay, so there is our free code for everybody. Reverse kissing toast theory. <laughs> exactly. Fought at the front. Okay, so we're starting off with an electric energy. Staravia. A Zwilus. Pupitar. Another Grimer. Clink. A Skitty. Pansage. 
a gullet, a reverse hollow, I can't even read that again, Darmantian, Darmanitian, 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 yes, that one, and a, another gothelet. Let's go ahead and pocket this one. Do I can do okay? Sword and shield or darkness of blaze? Little titty goth girlfriend. No, wrong, wrong, Etty. If you, you know the tip tock, it is big titty goth girlfriend, little titty goth wife. Don't you live all those children? Uh, say Pikachu is the strongest Pokemon in the Pokemon universe. It is technically going by the fucking anime series where he is able to beat every kind of Pokemon despite like type matchups being completely wrong. Sword and Shield it is. Like a Pikachu should not be able to electrocute an Onix. I mean they went way wrong right from episode like two. Like why? Okay. Pikachu OP. Guess what we just opened? Pikachu. <laughs> who would who would have thought, right? Okay, there's our free code. Apparently it's one of those ask and you shall receive days. So let's go four to the front. Okay, so we're starting off with a colorless energy. A heat more. Stunfisk. I swear the, the when they're using the name generator for this, it, it, they must just be like throwing things to the wall until something sticks. Hyper potion. Pikachu. The OP Pikachu. Meowth. Uh oh, a Galarian Mount Meowth. Sizzlipede. Sizzlepede. Sizzlepede? I, I, I haven't got a clue. A Wooloo. This is a fan favourite. I know this one. Uh, Wooloo has been built on our Minecraft server as well in pixel form. Uh, Groki or Grookey. Yeah, but the Galarian mouth Meowth looks wrong. Like I, I like the original Meowth because Team Rocket Meowth. Okay, so we have a Reverse Hollow Chinchow. And a Snorlax. My personal favourite is Snorlax because he is the one that reminds me of myself the most. And last but not least, the last Darkness Ablaze. Once again, a free code. Okay. Honestly, Snorlax, one of my favorite Pokemon. It, it took him, in the games, it took him nine generations to stand up, which I find hilarious. So we've got one, two, three, four to the front. So we have a fighting energy once again. Combo skin. Why why go for the dab? Why go for the dab? There are there are many more interesting uh, things to spend your points on. Although I guess uh, the gas 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 one would be a little bit pointless in this stream. Uh, another Staravia. Swilus, Grimer, Clink, Ducklet, a Mareep, a Paris, Reverse Hollow Ducklet, and a Draco Zolt.
go ahead and sleeve this one. Last but not least, the final tin. Once again, when using a knife, safety first, away from yourself. Honestly, I, I remember why, like, I got into Pokemon a long time ago, and I got into Magic of the Gathering years ago, and I always forget how much, I like, like opening packs has been called Cardboard Crack Addiction for a very good reason. Okay. We have our special card, which is the Eternatus. And it's beautiful, full hollow. You miss the smell of a freshly opened pack, oh yes. It is a very memorable smell. I think it's also a case of like, when you go into Magic of the Gathering, it's, you know what cards are just like insane to pull. Like I know obviously a lot of people know in the Pokemon world um, what are the most insane cards to pull, but for me in Magic of the Gathering, it's a little bit easier because everything is like, you know, it's the same sort of way as Pokemon with the, the but the rating scale on them is different. Um, so you can get uncommons that are worth more than rares and it just because of the functionality of the card. Okay. So we have Darkness Ablaze, Darkness Ablaze, Sword and Shield and Sun and Moon. I assume we're going to go in the same order as last time. We'll do Sun and Moon, Darkness Ablaze. No, Sun and Moon, Darkness Ablaze, Sword and Shield, then Darkness Ablaze. Yes? Okay. Let's start off with the Sun and Moon. The card. We have yet to find a God Pack. Who knows, maybe we'll get lucky. And this will be in a later pack. So we're going to go one, two, three, four. Starting off with a Leaf Energy. Grand Bull. Good old Metapod. Lily. Zero. Picky Peck. Sundial. Ratata. Snubble. Reverse Hollow. Steeny. And a. A Bewer. A B. It's a Beware. Fuck. Why? Why? That is an awful pun of a name for Pokemon. Why? You can... I feel like that's one of the times they went, Oh yeah, let's let the intern decide on a Pokemon name. Don't do anything stupid. Uh, it's like you can't do any worse than what we've already done for the past four years. Cool. What did, what did, he, what did he come up with? Uh, beware. And it is a fucking bear. What? Why? Just no. <laughs> okay. That is the place. One of the things that really annoys me is like, you'll go through the generations of Pokemon. It is a terrible, but brilliant name. I agree, Etty. Um, but when you go through the generations of Pokemon, the fact that they have, like, Pokemon from previous generations in this generation. I feel like that shouldn't be a thing. So like you'll have Gen 1 Pokemon appearing in like later generations of Pokemon. Like obviously I get Pikachu is in every single one nearly, but come on, why? Anyway, run over. 
free pack. We're gonna go one, two, three, four. So we have an electrical NG, Vibrava, Corvusquire, Rose, a Jigglypuff, a Ducklet, Carablast, Galarian Darumaka, Lavitar, Pansage, Oh, reverse Hollow Pan Sage, my bad. Yeah. And a Hollow Pin Churchin. There we go. So two more to add to the file. There we go. So now it's a sword and shield time. It's you naming your streams. I mean, fair enough. I I stopped naming my streams after a while, to be honest. I, I just... When, when a lot of the streams were literally me just carrying on the thing from before, I just kind of got annoyed at having to put, like, building an empire part 10, building an empire part 11. Because I like if I, if I change game, half the time I'd forget what part I was on. So I'd have, like, three part sevens or something. You know, it used to just annoy me. <laughs> There's our free code once again. Oh. And one, two, three, four to the front. Okay. So <laughs> we have a colorless energy. Pokey Kid. That is literally me if I had that kind of money. Uh, energy search. Team Yell Grunt. Team Yell, really? Tutel. Clearly not a cross between Bulbasaur and fucking Squirtle. Clear no, no. Who would have do such a thing? Um, a Blip Bug. A Rhyhorn. Lobopus. Wow! The originality of some of these names. Goldeen. We have a Reverse Hollow Krabby. And a Noctowl. Let's put the Reverse Hollow Krabby into the side loader. Okay, Darkness Blaze once again. You had a Poke Kid hoodie a few years back. Best money you ever spent. I have a po I have the Pikachu hoodie somewhere in my room uh, next door. Um, that has is the one from I, your UK. Your UK. So you know the game place game, right, Etty? Um, they were selling it in there, and I just had to have it because they actually had my size for once. Once again, free code. And we're gonna go one, two, three, four to the front. I got that Pikachu hoodie. I think you know exactly which one I'm on about. Okay, so, Grass Energy. Clang instead of Clink. Very good. Simi Sage. Billowing Smoke. Larvesta. Morlul. <laughs> Toxel. Skitty. Rowlet. Reverse Hollow Mareep. One of the ones I was actually hoping for when I found Mareep in the uh, packs before. And a, another... I still can't pronounce this one. Daramant Daramanitan. Let's go ahead and put the Mareep away. 
I've just noticed that, um, yeah, we've only had one reverse hollow fire type so far. Okay, now we're moving on to the lunchbox tins. So let's go ahead and get the knife out. Again, health and safety, make sure you cut away from yourself so you don't hurt yourself if it slip. No, I, I'll be honest, if I, if I was seven again, I would definitely be taking this to school. I'd be thinking I was the shizzle right here with this as my lunchbox. I mean, it, the lunchbox would probably be empty because I'd have eaten everything on the way to school, but I would have it as my lunchbox. Let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. So we have the three foils. Let's have a look see what we've got here. Cinderace, Rillaboom, Rilla and Interleon. We also have our Pokemon coin, which I can't get out. The Pokemon coin is stuck. God damn it. Ah, fucking love. I mean, there's so many renditions of Pikachu. Like, the original Pikachu. So, there is our Pokemon coin. A v Max Charizard, it looks like. Um, the original Pikachu card. He is a small, round, fat, yellow mouse. And I fucking love that shit. So, I'm just gonna close this again while I put these into the binder I hate when they're in like this because you've got to like try and get them out without bending them which is always really annoying that's one I'm actually quite surprised most of these have really good centering um, and if you don't know what I mean by centering, it's the yellow edge line you have all the way around. Um, when you get them graded, like if you're, if I was looking to sell them like PSA 10s and stuff, the, the stuff that they look for is centering is one of them. Um, and that can, if it's left or right, that can obviously affect the value. There we go. Remove this, back open to the tin. So inside this tin we have five card packs. Once again, free code, anybody that wants it. We have our five packs to open. We also receive some lovely stickers because stickers are awesome and everybody loves stickers. Look at him. Look at him. He's so round. Gotta love Pikachu and his redundantness. Next we have what looks like a notepad. And a lovely one card side loader. I want to squish him with a hug. He does look like a squishmallow. There we go. We have our little pack for looks like 30 cards. Let's go ahead and remove this. Okay, so we have Sword and Shield, Sun and Moon, Burning Shadows, Sun and Moon, Sword and Shield, Vivid Voltage, and Sword and Seed, Vivid Voltage. So I'm going to move these out of the way, because it appears that I have now started like six different collections of Pokemon. I want to try and keep them relatively the same. 
I will go dealer's choice. Um, we can either do... Nope. Sun and Moon. Sun and Shield. Viv's Voltage. Burning Shadow Viv's Voltage. Which I think is probably the best order. Because we want to end on trying to get that fucking V Max Pikachu. Okay. Let's get a Sun and Moon. Once again, free card, pack, whatever you want to call it. Very nice. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four. Okay, so we're starting off once again. Colorless energy. Corsola. Trumbeak. Energy switch. Oh, I should. I should have been doing my announcer's voice, shouldn't I? And here we have Zubat. Shelder. Young Goose. Paris. Caterpie. Reverse Hollow Ratata. And. Cosmoium, which is really adorable. Go ahead and put the Rattata into the folder. Then we said Sword and Shield. You want to let me pick? Oh, aren't you nice? <laughs> Once again, free card pack. I guarantee there's just like one person silently sitting in the stream just going right I'm gonna write all of these down and he's just sat there with a hundred pounds worth of codes a hundred packs worth of codes even okay so we're starting off with a grass energy a B sharp Salazel Doug Trio Silly Cobra Yamper Grookey Kufant Boltoy Reverse Hollow Team Yell Grunt and a Sandaconda. Now I want to make sure these are going into the same pile, so I believe it's this one. Yep, those are the same. Okay, next is Vivid Voltage. The newest of the packs, I believe. Here we have... Hey, another free one. My Sandaconda don't want unless you got buns on. <laughs> yeah. The fact that it evolves from something called Silly Fucking Cobra. Like, come on. This is great. A fucking Silly Conda. Oh my days. Okay, starting off with Colorless Energy. Heroes Medal. Hitmontop. Crocoro. Blizzle. Oh man. Milsery. Skiddy. Eevee. Trubbish. This is literally the card that I use as my excuse for like moaning and saying that the developers of Pokemon have run out of ideas for cool Pokemon. They made sentient trash, like literal trash. Come on. Reverse Hollow Garvantula. And an Exploud. Like, you cannot tell me any otherwise that they did not start running out of ideas for Pokemon 
when they started making trash cans fucking sentient. Next we have Sun and Moon Burning Shadows. I was not made by the Pokemon team, I'll have you know. Oh wow, okay, that self-decorating joke. I, I can I can see that, yeah. I too was also not made by the Pokemon team. I am also too sentient trash. Here we have Psychic Energy. Porygon 2. Charmeleon. Wabfit. An Oddish. Duskull. Esper. Molul. Charmander. Reverse Hollow. Oddish. And a Dark Ride GX. Our first GX of the day. Very nice. Let's have a look at that centering, see if the centering's any good. Centering is not great. It is more to one side, but uh, no matter, no matter. Stick that straight into the folder. If I had a top loader, that would be where that one was going. Here we have the last pack of Vivid Voltage from this tin. Okay, once again, free. I'm glad the music's managed to stay relatively, like, calm for, for what I've been doing. Because I know there's some hard style mixed into this playlist. Okay. For the first time on stream, Water Energy. Crocoroak. Delmise. Rocky Helmet. Chimichow. Chimicho, Nin Ninkeda, Voltorb, Rockruff, Wisma, Celebi, Hollow Celebi, and Terrakeon. Now I believe the Hollow Celebi is actually one of the ones that's worth a fair amount because that that art is. Absolutely beautiful with colour. Like my camera does not do it justice, but oh the etching is just I love it. If I was gonna get a watercolour uh, kind of tattoo, maybe not with Celebi on it, but that would be the exact thing I would want behind it. Oh yeah. Master Porky with the raid of three, much appreciated. How is your raid day going? How is your stream? We have just pulled a shiny Celebi. Absolutely love it. Yo, what is up? Master Porky with the Fallen, much appreciated. You get to see the Psychedelic Stream Parrot, which is the best gift on the internet. Thank you very much for following. Let's go ahead and slide you in. There we go. Okay, time to open box number two. You had a 16-inch stack of Pokemon cards laying around, you forgot where they are though. Also, hey, I recommended the raid. Much appreciated, one legend. Alrighty, let's go ahead and open up the tin once again. Remember, safety first. Knife away from yourself. You don't want to hurt yourself if you slip. No worries, one legend. Thank you very much for dropping by and thank you for recommending me as a raid destination. I do appreciate it. Ah, uh, my strength is starting to fail. There it is. Oops, a daisy. Lovely tin. Absolutely love this. Once again, the three Cinderace, Inteleon, and Rillaboom. And that lovely coin. We already have those, so we're going to put them to one side for the time being.
Now we've already seen these, but I will show them off anyway once again. Look at that beautiful Pikachu. That is the card that we want from these Vivid Voltage cards. It is great. Master Porker redeeming the uh, posture check, even though you can't see my posture, but okay, thank you. My posture was actually quite bad, so I, I do appreciate that. Readjust. So after the multiple stickers, we have Hades Pokemon. We have the notepad. And the very small one card per sheet protector. There it is, with the Pikachu on the front, with Charizard on the back. Let's go ahead and spread these out. Okay, so. If you are into the online version of the game, here is uh, code number like 30 or something. I don't know. There's been tons. Go ahead and pause if you want to write that down. Okay, so we have Vivid Voltage, Vivid Voltage, Sword and Shield, Sun and Moon, Burning Shadow, and Sun and Moon. We're going to go in the same order as last time, which is going to be Sun and Moon, Sword and Shield, Vivid Voltage, Sun and Moon, Burning Shadow, and finally, the last Vivid Voltage. Let's get into it. These are the last packs that I will be opening today. Here is the next code. Okay, so we're going to go four to the front. Starting out, we have a grass energy, double colorless energy, Corsola, Ultra Ball, Dratini, Cutie Fly. Chinchow, Molul, Skimori, Reverse Hollow Metapod, and a Primarina. So the codes again are for the online version of the card game. Um, when you open up uh, one of these packs, it gives you a code. You can use the code to redeem the same pack. Um, in the online version of the game. These are all of the codes we have pulled so far. They are all on stream. Um, yeah, free. Anyone can take them. Do whatever they want with them. I do not care. Let's go ahead and move that over to Sun and Moon. Oh, Sword and Shield next. Neither do I. I just collect them because they're shiny and I like to collect shiny things. Let's go ahead and open up the next pack. Once again, free code. Okay, so we're going to go one, two, three, and four to the front. I just like watching openings too. I, I agree. It is very interesting to watch. Especially if they know they've pulled something amazing. So we have an electric energy. Rare Candy, Liam uh, Lumberry, even Corvusquire, Cottony, Scorbunny, Silly Cobra, Grookey, Kufat, another reverse hollow Chinchow, and a hollow. Frostmoth. Let's go ahead and put them into uh. Yep, it is the exact same hollow Chinchow as before. But that's okay. 
Here are all of the hollows we have gained so far. Not including this one. I haven't put it in yet. But here is number one. The best one. The Pikachu. Full hollow. So far, we have Suicune, Tauros, Togedemaru, Sinistee. Tyranitar. Oop, I am going in the wrong. There it is. Tyranitar. The one that I can't pronounce very well. Darminitan. Eevee. Um, another one that I really struggle to pronounce, which is Paiukumunikun. I'm not even going to try again. Gotta flex them cards, exactly. Then we have Reverse Hollow Ducklets. Reverse Hollow Steeny. Reverse Hollow Jinjo. The Eternatus. There it is, Eternatus. Which is out of the box. Uh, there we go. So, Reverse Hollow Ratata. Sindrace. Lutaloan and Rillaboom. Again, out of the box. Payukumuku. That makes more sense. Thank you. Uh, reverse Hollow Mareep. Reverse Hollow Krabby. Reverse Hollow Pin. No, Full Hollow. No, just Hollow. Shiny Pin Searching. And Reverse Hollow Pansage. Here we have Reverse Hollow Garvantula. Reverse Hollow Oddish, Reverse Hollow Team Yell Grunt, a Dark Rai GX, a Shiny Celebi, Reverse Hollow Shinshao, Shiny Frostmoth, and a Reverse Hollow Metapod. That is all we have opened so far. There's them ones. No, is it? Yes, yes, it is. Okay. So, next we'll be opening up. Uh, that's yours. That's yours. I'm getting no notifications at the moment. So, let's open up Vivid Voltron. Again, we are hoping for that beautiful VMAX Pikachu. Once again, free code. One, two, three, and four to the front. All right, starting off with a fighting energy. I will keep following fighting energy. I don't know if it's rock energy. I ain't got a clue anymore. They look so similar. The fist makes me think it's fighting energy, but I could be wrong. Nuzleaf. Memory capsule. It is fighting, good to know. Uh, Girafferig. Eevee. C dot Electric Clefairy Fanfi Reverse Hollow Taylo and a Shrifty. There is our Reverse Hollow Taylo. I'm not sure if I'm a fan of the Plasticine model or the plastic model. Um, as the main picture, but nothing I can do about that. That is the way it is. Next up is the Burning Shadows Sun and Moon. You could get a new GPU just by selling a collection. Holy hell. Taylor is adorable. Um, yeah, my whole collection is not worth checking. I can tell you that now. Ooh. There we go. Free code. Don't say that you sign off. One, two, three, and a four. Starting out with a dark energy. Super scoop up. Electabuzz. Sophocles, Tynamo, Crabrawler, Inkay, Ladybug, 
Sandygast. It is a haunted sandcastle. Reverse hollow turtonator. And a muck GX. Very nice. Let's go ahead and put both of those into the folder. Okay. Last but not least, the very last Vivid Voltron pack. And it does feel a little bit heavy, so here's hoping we might have something good. Free code, the last one of the stream. Card trick, one, two, three, four. Okay, starting off. Electric Energy. Stunfisk. Aromatic Energy. Mighty Yena. Cottony. Arokuda. Ninkada. Picky Peck. Puchiena. Shiny Rayquaza. And a Tukananon. But mainly, the Shiny Rayquaza. That is a beautiful card. I absolutely love it. Again, the colouring behind the Rayquaza is something I would be more than happy to get as my watercolour tattoo. Absolutely beautiful there. Let's go ahead and put that in. To our slider. Okay, we will go through one last preview of what we have unveiled today. So we have Reverse Holo Suicune, Reverse Holo Taurus, Reverse Holo Togedomaru, Reverse Holo Sinistee. Hollow Tyranitar, Full Hollow Eevee. I have got to, there it is. Uh, I'm a Rayquaza guy, one legend, it's Rayquaza. Um, Piyu Kumoku, Reverse Hollow, Reverse Hollow Chintao, Reverse Hollow Ducklet, Reverse Hollow Steeny, Full Hollow Eternatus. Yep, same as me then. Okay. Reverse Holo Krabby. Reverse Holo Mari. No, Reverse Holo Mari. Holo Pinsachini. Pin Pinsachin. Pinsachin. There we go. I am trying to read upside down. It is not working. Reverse Holo Pansage. Holo Rillaboom. Holo. Inteleon. There it is, there it is, there it is. Syndrace, Hollow, and Reverse Hollow, Ratata. Next we have Reverse Hollow, Garavantula. Reverse Hollow, Team Yell Grunt. Full Hollow, Dark Rai GX. And Reverse Hollow, Oddish. Then we have our beautiful Hollow Celebi, another. Reverse Holo Chinchow. Holo Frostmoth. And Reverse Holo Metapod. And bringing us to the end. That beautiful shiny Rayquaza. The Reverse Holo Tertinator. The Reverse Holo Taylo. And the Muck GX Full Holo. That is everything for today. That was over £100 worth of Pokemon cards.